They're racist. I know. No, no. As a matter of fact, I'm uh, tied up in a, in a conference. Yeah, yeah, conference. Yeah, honey, I'm working. I'll call you tomorrow, all right? Bye-bye. Working? Is this how all writers work? <laughs> honey, it's not what's that on paper. It's all up in here. The play is finished. In a couple of days, I'll crank the old ear. The whole thing will come out in book form. And it wins a Pulitzer Prize. Oh, oh very good. <laughs> of course. I even have my speech prepared. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, today you're honoring me for my maiden solo effort, The Midas Touch. <laughs> no, no, I must decline the prize. It's prize enough to know that I've done it all without the aid of my ex-partner, George Livingston, and that I've learned that great lesson of independence. You've got to do it. You've got to do it. You've got to do it all alone. Today, and she can't wait to hear those last two acts. 
I, I tried to stall her, but uh, you're going to have to show up at my office tomorrow and show her at least an outline. How about uh, 12 o'clock? Oh. oh, sure, old wizard, old boy, 12 o'clock on the dot, you know? And Jeff, if you don't show, Paula is going to walk. And you know what? So am I. I need mean, a Jeff, I've had it with you. This is your last chance. Good night, Jeff. Good night, buddy. Good night. Good night. He's a million less. Once you get to know him. Now, let's get some drinks. Come on. Well, we have to be going now, Jeff. Oh, there's one in ICAP. Are you sure you're going to be all right, Jeff? Oh, sure. Deadline's the best thing for a writer. Gives him something to aim at. Builds a fire under him. Good night, Jeff. Good night. Well, nothing like a cozy little fire. Couldn't have been up your trouser leg. Well, better get to work. Ah, shut up. Hello. Oh, Mr. Boss, oh, Mr. Hastings called. Oh, yeah, Mom, I know. He was just here. Hey, listen, Mom, I'm going to be working late tonight. I don't know what time I'm going to be getting to bed. But no matter what, wake me up at 7 o'clock. 7 a.m.? 7 a.m. Don't worry, Mr. Moss. I'll wake you. Good night. Hey, wait, wait, Mom. Are you still there? Oh, uh, yes, Mr. Mom. Mama, I thought you might have a minute to talk with me tonight. Well... <laughs> I thought we might sit around and, you know, chew the fat, shoot the breeze room. <laughs> uh, I'm afraid. You mustn't be. Oh, I know you've told me that a thousand times before, but not. this is my last chance. But, Mr. Moss, you can write alone. I know you can. <laughs> you know, Ma, you're right. And I will. Remember, 7 o'clock. Let 
time enough to get in shape when the play's on. <laughs> 